John Sessions, a man of many faces. Hello, this is Richard Attenborough up here. Ah, this is Alec Guinness. Uh, yummy, yummy, yummy. <laughs> Funny for my monster tummy. I think I've got it now. The monster with the man's head. You're doing the tempest, aren't you, guys? <laughs> Reflections on life and the universe. John Sessions' Likely Stories begins tomorrow at 8.20 on BBC Two. I had no prior knowledge of the Watergate break-in. For the first time, the president's men reveal the full extent of the White House crimes known as Watergate. There was pressure from the White House, from me and from the president, to the committee to get their campaign intelligence activity going. They were carrying out Richard Nixon's instructions day to day. I said, I don't care how you do it, the president wants the papers back. That's all I know. To me, it was a throwaway project. You know, give Liddy the quarter million dollars and let's get him off our back. And he said, can you get into the Watergate office building. Previously missing documents, tapes from the Oval Office bugging system, a new five-part series for BBC Two, Watergate, the untold story, starting tomorrow at 8.50. And Watergate is the theme of tonight's film on BBC Two. All the President's Men is the story told from the perspective of the two journalists who unearthed the scandal. Robert Redford and Dustin Hoffman are the leading players in this tough, talking, Oscar-winning political thriller. Well, the first part of BBC Two's Watergate documentary is at 8.50 tomorrow night, and on Monday evening at 11.15, Whatever Happened to Woodward and Bernstein traces the journalists' fortunes in the 20 years since they became household names. You've seen the fact. Now see the fiction. This is what they said in 1977. Gripping stuff. The most compelling thriller of its kind ever. Just as engrossing as I, Claudius. Now that's the kind of news I like to hear. See what you think in 1994. Washington Behind Closed Doors starts next Saturday on BBC Two. Well, with all this conspiracy and corruption, we were all busy watching that film, and someone's pinched their hands on our clock. Would you mind putting them back now, please? Thank you, that's better. Well, as you can see, it's time to shred the BBC Two scripts, hide the negatives, and sneak off into the night. Good night. <laughs>